Congressman Dennis Ross also announced today he will not seek re-election. Friends at Ross are telling us this was a planned and thought-out move. News Channel 8's Jeff Patterson joins us now live in downtown Tampa. Jeff. Good evening, Jen. Congressman Ross says he wants to come back home to practice law, but some are questioning the timing of that announcement. Before Congress, Dennis Ross practiced law. In his announcement today, Ross says he wants to come back home to do that job. I've actually talked to him this morning, and this was expected. Deborah Tamargo is the second vice president of the Federation of Republican Women in Florida and a friend and supporter of Ross. She believes his announcement today fulfills an original campaign promise. He ran with term limits not becoming a career, but observing the constitutional intent that you go, you serve, you come home. USF political expert Dr. Susan McManus believes there is more involved with the decision. There's discord everywhere, a lack of civility. Uh, absolutely, you talk to any Congress member quietly and they'll tell you there's certainly that. And there's also this idea that if I even try to work with the other side, I'm going to be punished by my own party. Dr. McManus believes the congressional district being vacated by Ross is very conservative and still a likely Republican stronghold. The question is, who will take the seat? It is rare that a congressional seat comes open, which means you're likely to have lots of candidates. Uh, Dr. McManus told me, as you just heard, there may be a long list of Republicans and even some Democrats who will file for this race. But timing is tight. The filing deadline is just a few weeks away. Live in downtown Tampa, Jeff Patterson, News Channel 8.